Shout to my sound guy in the building. Man. Everyone's starving, a couple of people are fat. We're taking it back so everybody can eat. Movies, radio, books, everything. Fashion, everything. And when we have it, no one's gonna have a boss. Everyone's gonna be a boss. Some people that ain't the world, but to where we come from, it's like extreme wealth. You gotta be able to compete, still shop and still. You gotta get out there and you gotta earn your spot. It's not given. I set examples. That's what I do with my team. So whenever you see Rose coming, he speak highly of his team. If you a G or you a boss, you respect that. Yeah. Hey man, it's Mad Miles, also known as Fresh Ass Deuce. Welcome to Urban Kings and Queens podcast today. Shout out to Crack Diesel. What up, bro? Games on Cracks. Sound guy, Young it's Slaps is in the building you? as well. You know what it is. Appreciate you, sir. You know we got a, we got a great guest, very funny guest. I'm a huge fan. Guy been putting in work a long time. Go ahead, introduce yourself, sir. <laughs> What's up, man? It's comedian J Rose. What's the deal? All the egos. <laughs> who else? Who else in the hey, building? Nigga, uh, uh, <laughs> make us laugh. <laughs> hey. <laughs> You know how niggas do a Tell a joke. Tell us a joke. <laughs> what Kanye do to Dave Chappelle? <laughs> Tell right, us right. a joke. Right. Hey, like, dog. Yeah, uh, you know, AKA Airway Jenkins, yeah. AKA. <laughs> I'm watching the slip on. Very slip on. Who, Terry? When the trap house went crazy. Man, <laughs> hey, I was trying to go so hard for that video, dog, because I wanted to top the first one when I had the mannequin. Yeah. And I couldn't top it. You don't think so? It didn't. It didn't okay. go. It didn't go as good That's as crazy. the first one, as far as uh, views went. Okay. But let's get straight to it. Um, Spooty actually put me up on you. Okay. Shout out to Spooty. Um, Shout out to Spooty. That's my guy. We gonna talk about. Um, but where? Uh, where are you from? Uh, Detroit, West Side, uh, Burwood, and Curtis. Uh, That's where my grandma stayed. At. <laughs> I grew up mostly with my grandma and uh, my mom in uh, Oak Park on Nine Mile and Kipling, I believe. Mm-hmm. But uh, we ended up moving with my grandma, and then we moved again to our own house on the west side. So, so my question is: Was you the funny guy at the lunch at the lunch table? Like, was oh, you yeah. roasting everybody? Oh yeah, niggas was getting blazed. Okay. Niggas was getting cooked. <laughs> Man, we was I was getting cooked. We everybody was getting cooked. We was cooking everybody. Everybody's getting cooked every day. That was a different time. So, man. Yeah, that was that was good times. People's emo- people too emotional now. Yeah, them was the best times, man. They was emotional back then, though. So that's what you cook. I mean, you can people? only cook with, like with your friends, though, bro. Nah. Yeah. What? Yeah. Nah, bro. Nah, nah, yeah it was nah, emotional nah. back you start then. Start cooking like niggas outside the table. Don't fuck yeah. with outside the table. Yeah, yeah. that shit gonna turn that's into that's some that. shit. It got a little ugly. one dude. Yeah. Like, was hell no. Cook- we was cooking one dude <laughs> in my art class, dog. We was cooking one dude so long. It was like after a while, he just stopped laughing. He got like, <laughs> he kind of got serious, but he wasn't really serious, serious. But we was like, hey. We need to chill for bro bring like a gun up here tomorrow. Yeah, so trailer, like, <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, have a class, dog. Yo, me and Steve. <laughs> me and my nigga Steve, man, we had we had art class where we used to cook a nigga in that bitch. Like he was as tall as fuck. He used to wear like this yellow sweater, so we just call this nigga banana boy every day. <laughs> Big bird for sure. Yeah, just used to be cooking this nigga. He got mad one day, bro. We just like, all right, we're gonna chill on dog. Shut yeah, the fuck up. Nigga, get the, get the <laughs> tripping in this bitch. Shut bro. y'all ass up over there in that <laughs> like, corner. We used to, <laughs> it started with me and him, then everybody just started, you know what I'm saying, calling this nigga that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, enough yeah. is enough. You know, oh, people, yeah. people be crazy. cool until other people join. He should have came, came to class in a banana suit, nigga. My <laughs> nigga, I would have been his friend right now. I was like, that's some clever <laughs> shit. <laughs> that's some clever shit, buddy. Uh, what high school? Mumford. Oh, yeah, man. uh class of 07. Okay. Yeah. Mumford was yeah. cool, man. It was uh it was cool. It was cool all years. It wasn't as rough as everybody think it is. It was rough, but 
It went that rough when we was there. Same like that. As all know. the other Detroit public schools. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. To be honest. When you yeah, it's like when you in there, it's like, man, it's normal. But yeah. somebody else comes. But the like, beginning it's a <laughs> fucking jungle, bro. I yeah, swear yeah, it's yeah. like, all right. Um when you was roasting people, did you think you was gonna be doing this now? Nah, uh, I wanted to be an NBA player, dog. I ain't even gonna okay. lie to you. I had that dream. I had that dream for the long. That's probably what, why I do the Ray Jenkins so much. But I had that dream until like eleventh grade when I finally tried out for the team. Mm. Man, I went to tryouts. Man, I'm doing good though. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I'm balling. I could ball though. Okay. Like yeah, no, I can <laughs> Listen, I see the step backs, the heads <laughs> yeah. just can't move. The nigga who can't play can't fake that shit. <laughs> yeah, I used to, I used to ball though, but uh, <laughs> I was doing my thing, but I was nervous. He had us do like this one drill, and I ran like around to the other side of the court and wasn't supposed to. <laughs> he like, hey, big man. <laughs> Hey, to the crib, big man. Like, damn. <laughs> like, like to the crib. Yeah, they weren't playing. If you weren't listening <laughs> oh to no God. direct order, to the crib. It's over man. with. To the crib. You ain't making it. <laughs> after that, <laughs> <laughs> after that, I went to my grandma's house, man. I damn near cried. Like, so that's it? Like, I ain't going to the league? Like, I ain't about to be on varsity or nothing? <laughs> like, damn. But you it's, know what's crazy, though? Because thinking about it, like, a lot of people, like, just seeing the camps and the trainings that be going on right now, mm. we didn't have the access to that shit like that, or we just didn't know about them. Didn't know about them and didn't have access on Cause top like of said, it. Cause like you said, you was just done after the tryouts. I was done after the tryouts. I ain't know nothing about going it's, to no it's AAU. It's kids now that be doing all that. If they don't get cut, they going, they go figure it out. Mm -hmm. Their parents figuring out, they, all right, you go go train during this season, they come back better. So that's some shit I feel like we we didn't have that these kids don't take advantage of for real. I ain't nah. gonna say everybody, but some of them don't. Exactly. And then my mama, she ain't tell me like, that was like a false hope. Like, cause I ain't never get past 5'11", you know what I'm saying, mm -hmm. as far oh, as the man. height. Yeah, and then that's tough. <laughs> she was just supportive the whole yeah. time. Like, no, nah, you know, you can play, you good, you, you might make it. Like, nigga, please. I'm trying to think, <laughs> talk about some nigga, please. I'm, <laughs> The small dudes in the NBA, Nate Robinson. Yeah. Yeah. Spud. Yeah. Spud Webb. Muggsy. Boy. Who it's else? Bad boy. My guy. Was, my guy was Iverson. I was about to that say was, Iverson probably held it down the most. That was the Nate whole Robinson reason why I even was like trying thinking about shit. trying to go to the NBA was Iverson. Yeah. Huh? Who? Is he? Damn. Shout out to Tony Parker. <laughs> Use that short. Yeah, I think Iverson really like five eleven. He ain't. You know really they boost him up a real bit sometimes. Yeah, he like he... five eleven. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> niggas light skin coalition know league. about the light skin yeah. coalition, man. Y'all niggas go crazy. So let all right. So we I got uh we got a podcast called Top Ten. So go ahead and give us at the time since you was a basketball fan your top ten NBA players mm. at that time. When back uh, in high, high school, school yeah. shoot, it was Allen Iverson for sure. Kobe, uh, LeBron, um, probably like KG. KG basketball. <laughs> yeah, I gotta really you think, one, man. man. In high school, I do a. Uh, Man, who was killing it? Oh, you know what? Gilbert Arenas was killing it back then. Talk about how about yeah. Yeah, I think niggas, niggas failed to mention him amongst. Yeah, he was killing it. Like when, when, when niggas bring lists up, they just like lead. You know what I'm saying? They don't put, they don't put oh, him Gilbert? on there. Yeah, they don't put him on there a lot. It's just his I mean, career was just so short. Shots and shit, bro. Niggas was trying to kill That's niggas. even more reason <laughs> to put him on. It's even more reason I'm going to finish the five, bro. Um, at that time. Um, McGrady. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Tim Duncan. Timmy. Shaq. Shaq back then? Wait, what year? No, what, year? what you talking about? Seven. I'm talking about from 2000 to 2010. Oh, okay, okay, okay. My yeah, bad. Shaq in there. My sure. bad. Cool. My bad. Yeah, Shaq in there. Shaq um, in there. You know who people sleep on, bro? Who niggas really couldn't check? Who? Cool. Paul Pierce, man. Yeah. Niggas really could not check Paul Pierce, bro. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think up, niggas bro. sleep on him. 
Man, listen. It's the corny ass nigga. That's what, that's all, that's bro. Of course. <laughs> yeah. That's all it is. The nigga bro. is the truth. Like, yeah, the nigga is yeah, the come truth. Come on, man. But, um, shit, that's some shit. It was that nine. Can't forget about it. Who was that? Uh, was Brandon Roy playing? Yeah, yeah Brandon, Brandon Roy was playing back then. He was nice. That injury fucked Brandon Roy up. Man. Terribly. Terribly. All right, man. So, how, where, did, where did comedy come from? NBA ain't work out. <laughs> <laughs> comedy was like always there. I just ain't know. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? I was always funny. Um, as far as I can remember, like like second grade, I'd be cracking jokes or whatever, you know, talking my little shit. And then it, all of a sudden, it'd be like a little crowd of us just laughing. And I just realized, like, damn, okay. Like everybody laughing at my shit. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? But I ain't really take it seriously until after high school like I was late like it was probably like when I when I like you said when I found out I wasn't gonna go to the league <laughs> my mama was like uh as far as college go you need to just figure out what you really want to do you know what I'm saying because I ain't I don't want you to go to college and it ain't nothing that you want to do or it's just something you, everybody wants you to do or you really gotta go to you know go for what you want to do or you're not gonna want to go so she was like, just think about what you're good at, and you know, we're gonna figure it out from there as far as schools and all that. So, I, you know, I gave her some thought, and I was like, man, the only thing I've ever been good at other than basketball, I felt, was, you know, making people laugh. So, yeah. I was like, well, you know, what if I go to like acting school or something like that? My mom was like, acting school, like, you know how much money that is, and blah, blah, blah. I'm like, well, I wanna do comedy, you know, I wanna, you know, I wanna be an actor, I wanna be a comedian. She was like, "What? Like, <laughs> like you, you know? What I'm saying? Like, that's a big uh, ass trip. Like, you, you go from basketball to yeah, to niggas laugh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it was, you know, it just ended up working out for me after that. But uh, yeah, I just lost my train of thought. But yeah, it was um, I I just decided I wanted to do comedy. I told my dad, my dad um. He wasn't around growing up, but he was in, you know, kind of around. Mm-hmm. So I, I remember I called my dad. I told him, like, man, my mama tripping, man. She talking about <laughs> acting school costs too much or whatever. I want to do comedy. He's like, are you even funny, though? I'm like, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> if you would spend some time with a nigga growing up, Talk maybe, that nigga. <laughs> maybe you would know, nigga. Talk to that like, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> like, damn. I had to hang up on cuz. Yeah. Like, hey, man. Fuck on. But, Did you anybody, know. like, inspire you? Coming up, like, were you watching any comedy? Was it any specials that, that you was, like, locking into? I used to always watch Dave Chappelle mm-hmm. before the Dave Chappelle show. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And uh, I used to always see him on, like, different shows, doing those little five minutes and all that. I used to be like, man, this dude is, like, hilarious. And uh, Martin Lawrence. Of course. And uh, Bernie Mac. Oh, yeah. You know, those was like... About you slaps. You going what? Uh, five, hmm. four, three. Uh, Dave Chappelle, Chris Rock. I'm this. This is no order. Um, Dave Chappelle, Chris Rock, Bernie Mac, Eddie Murphy. That fifth one up for grabs, cause that bitch changes all the time. Put them four, I think right that shit there. is very hard. Like them four right there, stay in there. When we the talk other, about a list, like, I think comedy is very hard to keep them in there. Yeah, man. but if niggas don't have like them four kind of in that top five know. area, that shit kind of weird. Chris though. Rock in my ten though. You ain't got Chris Rock up there. It's it's so close, bro. Cause Why it's not? like. He like six five. He like five six. It, it switches so much with me, bro. Yeah, I ain't everybody got, I hates ain't Chris. Lie. Is probably one of my favorite all, shows. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he he hilarious though. It's tough. Uh, he hilarious. Uh, niggas is crazy. It's, <laughs> it's we talk, wait, wait, what are we talking about? We talking about all time. That, that, that kind that's of what I'm saying. Are you talking all time or are we talking I'm about talking like? All time. Okay. You ain't you ain't the Richard Pryor in your five. He he. I mean, I, at while I know that like a lot of these niggas wouldn't be here without Richard Pryor. He's not in my father. It's kind of it's kind of like that he type of team. shit where like 
I'll respect niggas from back in the day, you know, motherfucking uh, battling on Queens Bridge and really shit, but I don't, I don't care. <laughs> oh, I, mean, I got to leave, my, dog. I don't like, I don't like. Too disrespectful like, right now. He, not, like, you, was, you was cool when I first came in. He dabbed me up. Over. The bridge he dabbed me up and everything. I was the don't compare that, that shit. shit. <laughs> he ain't KRS one, bro. Stop it. Come on, man. Try to hear that shit. You real disrespectful right now. He real disrespectful, dog. What's wrong with KRS one? Niggas would say that you disrespect. For saying that I'm being Fuck disrespectful for KRS One and them because he ain't it. <laughs> <laughs> Chris Rock is it. KRS One is not it. Nah, Richard uh, Pryor is definitely uh, he in my ten he, dog because he, he, he got one tier. of my favorite scenes ever dog. Him he and Eddie Murphy tier. that Harlem Night joint dog. Eddie, oh yeah, Eddie, 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 that's a classic. That's a classic right there. Mike Epps in the ten dog. Not Mike Epps. Mine. He ain't in your ten. No. What Mike Epps? Not a huge Mike Epps fan, man. That's crazy. Not what? Mike not even when? Not even the special when he was here in Detroit. Not a huge Mike Epps fan. Killed bro. Detroit, bro. Not, I think I'm that's what he got. You don't like next Friday? Right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay, 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 okay. I'm just be saying, no, no, no. He's just not a young. He's good at what he do. I just don't. We talking black, by the way. Excuse me. Be human. To hear that shit, bro. Jerry Seinfeld. They start thinking a bunch of white niggas. I was about to say Adam Sandler. Come on now. Jerry, Jerry and my <laughs> no, team. Jerry, Jerry, yeah. No, Jerry is funny. No, Jerry, as Jerry, for Jerry sure. Is That's why. I, listen, when people yeah. say Chris Rock, not funny, Chris Rock has both funny. He can lead the hood and go make some people laugh. Yeah, no, you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying. So that's why I get it. That's why I say he fifth, six with me. Tiffany Addis. <sighs> Talking shit. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that nigga face. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> <That's good. laughs> That's crack top tier, man. That's crack top tier. He ain't on cam, bro. Your face is just like, <laughs> yo. So she's not funny to you? No, uh, she funny, but yeah. top ten. Nah, I ain't even gonna. I ain't gonna disrespect. Oh. I ain't gonna disrespect her. Oh. <laughs> That's his girl. All man. praise to her hey, work. I dropped, the, I dropped oh. the games on crack <laughs> drop, buddy. All praise to her it. work, man. She doing her thing. What, what about Kevin Hart? Top ten. How do you feel about Kevin Hart? I I love Kevin Hart. But I I ain't gonna lie. When uh-huh. he started doing um um I forgot what's the first special they did, the big one. Where he did the uh the arena. The movie yeah, show. when he did when when he started doing the movies for him, that's when I kinda was like, All right, I don't really it ain't really the, you know that funny the more that to me, in my opinion, it was like that. But the one that he put on Netflix, I thought that shit was funny as hell, but it was like other people was like Nah, he fell off. I'm like, the one damn. With the, with the skit at the end where he was hiding weapons in the crib. Yeah. That shit was funny as fuck to me, bro. That shit was funny yeah, as hell yeah. to me. Is that so the one I'm with like, Holly That shit was hilarious, huh? Is that the one with Holly Bear? No. No, okay. not that one. Not that one. No, nah, the one where he's talking about gun that. compartments okay, yeah, and yeah, shit. I know what you're talking about. That, that, shit. Shit. <laughs> that shit was funny. That shit Kev was funny, funny as hell. Me, and I was like, why are everybody trying to down it now? I fuck with Kev. I don't get this niggas got tired of him, man. Like we gotta no, see that's you what it is. We gotta see you in Secret Life of Pets. I gotta see you here. I gotta see like, all right, my nigga. Yeah. Life of Pets. Yeah. I, I like them. Every Y'all ever seen? We go. Uh, like, yeah, I see your ass everywhere, Cap. Y'all ever seen Paper Soldiers before? No, I I actually got this on one of my co- yeah. One okay, of my okay. Shit. okay, 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 that's okay. That's the first movie okay. I think I seen yeah. him in. That's like prime Kevin Hart yeah, to me. Yeah, like Paper Soldiers, funny. seriously funny. Um, grown man. little man. Grown little man is the man, class. This, I respect, that's like, tears, bro. I respect this nigga though. Like, um, I mean, the, the grind for this nigga was crazy. It was, it was like real to say. Book and shit. So the grind was crazy. I can't, I can't hate on this nigga. Like, being on another level mm-hmm. with, with comedy, like on shoe, like selling out these arenas, doing movies. I. Nobody I respect, sold out respect, the arena like that, right? The shit out, I respect no. the shit out of that. That arena shit was crazy, bro. Like, he. A, like you say, a comedy rock star for he sure. He's top bro. ten, bro. Like he, he a comedy, yeah, he rock, a comedy star. rock star. So if we, he top ten, bro. His grind will put his grind will have me put that nigga top ten for sure. This nigga kind of just like the fuck you looking at, Kurt? Like, you know what <laughs> he saying? not he broke, top ten. He broke barriers, bro. It's like you got to throw him in top ten. Hold on, bro. Cause somebody just, barriers, bro. nah. Who? <laughs> Wait, I'm very interested. Who's yeah, in your top ten, Kurt? I, I, I gotta respect that. <laughs> you kind of got to huh? throw him in there. Crack is about to say. So I, listen, when the YouTube drop, I need you to be first in the comments. In that. <laughs> cool. Crack Diesel oh, will put his top about 10. To say, <laughs> Tiffany Haddish. Roger Dangerfield. <laughs> Roger <laughs> Dangerfield. <laughs> he about to bring. That was my guy though. <laughs> is he alive? Because I was gonna say R.I.P. to him, and I don't want to say it. He about to put all these niggas. 
Hey, can somebody look that up real quick? Fuck it. Shout out to Roger, dog. <laughs> <laughs> My dumb ass was about to say R.I.P. I don't even know if you dead or not. Who? <laughs> oh? Who? No, he funny as fuck. He oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's a lot of underground Deion folks. Cole. Is any underground people you want to yeah, shout out? Yeah, uh, Earthquake. Top 10, ridiculous. <laughs> Earthquake, well, earthquake ain't really earthquake underground. Earthquake ain't underground. Everybody but, know earthquake. Yeah, everybody know earthquake. Good but it, it's not too many people when they talk about comedy oh, no, talk about earthquake. Though. Earthquake is cold with it, but underground like he top five stand up to me. Earthquake. Earthquake, yeah. Yeah, he could be in my top five. His stand ups be fire. Yeah. Do you Ellen, Ellen, Ellen DeGeneres in, in your <laughs> Steve Martin, Steve Martin, hey man, Steve Martin. Steve Martin, he's a goat. Yeah, Steve Martin up there. I fuck with Steve Martin for real. Who? Nah. Got one. Got one to Sykes in that bitch. Yeah. (laughs) Shout out to Down to Earth. I heard Chris Rock was going getting off in that bitch. (laughs) Damn, Stephen Colbert. Man, these. I'm reading this list. I'm reading this list. What you Google? White comedians? <laughs> Louis C.K. Who else, man? I'm trying to think. Do y'all uh, do y'all fuck with D-Ray, man? Fuck with D-Ray. You fuck with D-Ray? D-Ray been cold D-Ray from like D-Ray. all the older movies used to do. Uh, Barbershop, um, Johnson Family Vacation. I don't know if y'all seen that one like one yeah. time at least. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, all the stuff he's. Oh no, nah, we do. movie guys over here. Yeah. So okay, yeah, okay, yeah. okay, okay. Nah, okay, for to, sure. Let's for get sure. to the movie comparisons then, real quick. Um, crack, you could just nod your head over there, cause you know, the wash or how high. Mm. Slaps, you already answered. Yeah, I, yeah, I yeah. Think so. Oh man, Mr. What? <laughs> he talking about some <laughs> what? <laughs> Damn. Hmm. I'm trying to imagine scene for scene right now. That's tough right there. Man, I'm, damn, man. I, I might have to, um, man. Mm. <laughs> yeah, that's, it's no, it, it might not be the wrong answer for this one. Um, I might say, I might say the wash, dog. I might say the wash. What you say, so, so, you know, oh, so, I think I went with how high too. But the I just watched the Watch Dog. Snoop is a motherfucker, bro. Dog, the, the, it's that beginning. <laughs> What's the, that the scene? Was a, it was a good movie, though. Like not not good as in. No, it was solid. Yeah, it was, for what it was. Just, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> like for, what, for what that shit was. And I'm with the AK. And I'm gonna spray like that's your guy, right? The Watch hilarious. Eminem. Ha ha, it's hilarious man, too, though. Huh? Based his whole career off of this nigga. Facts. Then let him. You go. like Eminem, bro? Then let him go to podcast. Yeah, I fuck with Eminem. Is he in your top five, top ten? Nah. Okay, cool. No. I ain't gonna lie to you. Eminem is somebody. <laughs> Eminem is somebody just like how we talking about yeah. Kevin Hart. Like yeah. he respect the craft. You know he put it in work. But I ain't about to bump yeah, that shit for real. Around, nigga. I can't bump it for real. Like that. It's hard. Nah, oh. Paper soldiers are buffed up. Oh, I ain't get this. This was no paper soldiers. Paper soldiers. Oh, damn. Is that man, easy? Fuck? Huh? Hell yeah. yeah. Man, listen. Uh, oh, oh, <laughs> Shout out to the city, man. Shout out to the Shout city, man. Buff Thug was cold. Buff Thug was cold. <laughs> but I gotta go with Paper Soldiers. <laughs> Talking Kevin Hart, yo. Kevin Hart, you feel me? This is when he was getting booed at the time, so I thought I threw that in there. Mm-hmm. Uh, Norbert or Nutty Professor? Nutty Professor. Who the fuck would say otherwise? A lot. Really? Yeah. Come on. Okay, I, bro, you know I'm not just gonna put some shit. Like I really looked and <laughs> seen. professor for sure. People Nutty like Respusha, man. All day. <laughs> People love her, bro. Sherman. <laughs> Who'd you rather take uh, to eat? <laughs> <laughs> Pick. Uh, what's the best Friday? The uh, first one for me, bro. Really? Yeah. I didn't expect that from you. Yeah. <sighs> That shit is classic. The bro. first one is for me as yeah, well. That shit is classic. But it's tough as the other fuck. Was, the other one's good and funny, bro. But that, bro, that first one is just man. a staple. I love three, though. It's, it's a staple, bro. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck it is about that third one, dog. 
I might say next Friday, bro. The second one. Yeah, Friday. It's it's yeah, easy to say Friday the first. Like us. <laughs> we ain't saying the shit about Chris Tucker either. No, like I mean, Friday. The first one is a classic. Like I'm, that's always like it's a good one. But it, I don't know. It was just a lot of hilarious shit that Mike Epps was doing, and so many quotes that people were still using. Yeah. You know, for so long from that movie. Like that shit was just hilarious, man. <clears throat> What's the best barbershop? Uh, I'd have to think on that, bro. Because I'm instantly going to say the first one, but I need I to probably the go second rewatch. One. I said the second one. I probably have to go rewatch. Yeah, I, I say I say the second one. Um, Wait a minute. Which one was the safari punch? Was that the first one? The safari punch? I think that was the first Man, one. I ain't watched barbershop <laughs> for so fucking long, bro. Which is so I'm damn near about to say neither because I can't remember no notable scenes from either of these movies. <laughs> so they all was trying to be like, ah, that shit, shit ain't stick with me. <laughs> the, the first one had the most substance, I think. I think the second and third was where it kind of got a little. Yeah, I think that's what all movies, honestly. I ain't gonna say all, but majority of the movies yeah. kind of fall off after the first one. Yeah, it went over to more like a corny type of cliche type of story after the first one, but. Second one was funny though. I mess with the second one. Coming to America or Harlem Nights. Mm. Mm. Talk about it. <laughs> Give my air horns Ooh. on that shit. Mm. Mm. Mr. Damon. Oh God! <laughs> no God, please no. Slip on right no. here. This is the, he's this in his top ten. Oh my God, now, he might be in mine, bro. Yeah, I ain't even go cap, no, bro. The office, nigga. The office is my show, 10. and I'm late on that shit. version, yeah, he is. I I probably say Harlem Nights. Hey, no, that nigga's that fucking hilarious. Almighty, <laughs> yeah, that nigga hilarious. Bro. You said who? What you pick? Yeah, I say Harlem Nights. Harlem Nights. I went with Harlem Nights too. Yeah, I say Harlem Nights. Shit, I mean, man, I think that's a I'm tough a motherfucking though. choice, bro. But Harlem Nights is like some of the funniest shit. <laughs> What's dog name with the glass? What is his yeah, real I'm, name? I might have to, Benny. I might have to go. Fuck! What is his damn name? Bro. I can't even think right I might now. Have to go Harlem Nights, bro. That's a tough. That's, that's that's tough. A tough choice, bro. That's a tough choice. Cause niggas sleep on Arsenio Hall, bro. And his mm-hmm. bag, he was in for the. What happened now? Anybody know? He just fell off. No, he still he still going. No, I'm talking about like when he was in his bag that he just kind of like. I don't know. I mean, I we was young. Still kind of respect our okay. like, yeah. He almost I had a show. Yeah, and shit. I want to say he almost started doing another show at first for a second. I remember he was about, to, start he was about to do some shit, like and then that. they and then go or something. I forgot, but all right, let's get let's move on. Hot box, hot box, hot box. Mm-hmm. That's what Spooky was in the car. <laughs> I think y'all the reason he edible crazy now. <laughs> Might be, Wait, he was he was smoking he wasn't smoking like doing that? Out? Not that I know of. That, that was a minute ago, bro. That's so what like, I'm saying. That yeah. was a while ago, bro. Maybe he was. I can't even remember. Spooky if he's the edible king now. Damn, man. that's fucked up. Always, I mean, always that's a good thing. Though, it's man. a good thing. He got his little <laughs> spooty juice now and shit. Damn, okay. I yeah. gotta fuck with him. <laughs> I ain't know Spooty Juice was out. Spooty ju- Damn. Spooty out here tripping. All because of that hot box episode. <laughs> uh, well, the Joke Club is the group, and it, okay. it consists of uh, three people, including myself, two of my homeboys that I went to high school with. Shout out to Mumford, you know what I'm saying? And uh, basically. <clears throat> When Instagram started doing like the, I want to say they were only doing like 15 second videos at mm-hmm. first, and everybody was like getting off with the comedy or whatever. I was just, I came in with an idea like, you know, we can do like a a video of us like on some like with weed content like in the car just smoking different scenarios and you know just you know cracking jokes like that. And niggas was like, nigga, what like? Yeah, I ain't, you know, just er, er, saying everything like, downers. yeah, just downing it, downing the whole time. Like, man, people really getting off on the comedy. And we had did like videos in the past, but we never did anything consistently. Mm-hmm. Like, we did like something like once, then maybe a year later, drop something else. But so my man was like, man, I don't expect nothing crazy, like no two hundred followers or nothing like that. Like, you know, I tried. So we ended up doing like the first couple videos. It was kind of shaky at first, and then we 
got like our little uh, like little groove of things or a setup of how we wanted to do it and how we wanted to shoot it and then start to take off after that so what do you remember the first one that hit like the first one this was a minute ago now I think about it though this like this yeah second videos yeah, we yeah. we started. I didn't know this uh, nigga existed then. Around that time, <laughs> cause like, it, till hot box it was low key was like ten years though, wasn't it? I mean, ten seconds for real. Was it ten seconds? I think it might have been. No, no, it was fifteen. It was such a short, it was a short ass, ass time. number. Yeah, like I just was didn't understand. Like, like, it was fifteen. It was the other thing that was like ten. That was uh, fine. Vine. Vine. Yeah, Vine, Vine was like I ten think seconds. Vine was good. Vine kind of got or five popular. seconds or something. What the crazy. fuck happened to Vine? I don't even know. <laughs> shit, bro. Dark skin uh, committee was just talking about that. Shit. <laughs> they was just talking about how they how they miss Vine. Like Vine hearing about was the TikTok <laughs> band. Vine was TikTok like, for real. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I mean, because they oh, was. Yeah. I was just uh, whining yeah. that they was about to lose TikTok. <laughs> and I'm like, bro, y'all just gonna go to something else. Whining, and right. we, we still miss Vine, though. Like, shut the fuck. Y'all ain't said shit about Vine in years. <laughs> y'all niggas I been on TikTok going crazy. Now. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, come on, man. We That's just go tough. to the next shit. Crack, you should go to the hot box, man. <laughs> <laughs> you and Finn. <laughs> <laughs> Go crazy. Yeah, it's gonna be sitting there but, uh, smoking the whole time. I can't even yeah. remember honestly which one was the video that took off because we used to just have like special guests on there. Mm-hmm. And I know uh, early on, Rocky Bad had came, fucked with us. That's what's up. And uh, shout out to her. Yeah, the episode I should have been at. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one. Yeah. Nigga been in the trunk smelling That's the, the seat. That's the one, right? <laughs> yeah. She was crazy because she a smoker now, nah, but back then, she wasn't even no smoke. She ain't smoke for real back then at all. Mm-hmm. That shit was so funny. We got some like old footage of her like trying to hit a bong, didn't even clear the damn bong. I never did that shit. I ain't clearing that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm probably not clearing like, that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm dying. But shout out to her. Like She came and fucked with us. Um, it was like people were just showing love early on. Uh, Detroit Hollywood, I don't know if y'all follow her. Um, uh, Be Real had hit us up from Cypress Hill. And uh, it was it was just a lot, a lot of love at first, you know what I'm saying, going on. Then it was, you know, internal things happened in the group. Things started going downhill. New addition uh, shit. <laughs> yeah, man, it was just who it the was, fuck was Bobby Bob? Y'all Bond? niggas getting to some money, <laughs> man. No, that's man, the thing. That's, <laughs> that's the thing. Money, it, it wasn't even. Involved. Yeah, money wasn't even involved. It wasn't like we. It was people ideas for like they weren't getting heard as far as skits. Like, man, we need to shoot this, but we ain't shoot this idea. Yeah, we ain't do this or a lot of stuff, man. Um, we was doing a uh, radio show, and I was paying for the the rent the fee for the radio show. I ain't want the group to pay because they really they want to do a podcast on their own. They ain't want to do a podcast with a different uh, platform. So I, you know, I'm like, man, we got the whole setup. They got the platform already. We just gotta come do our thing. We good. I'm paying for it. Everybody else, nobody else gotta pay for. It. I ain't even tripping. Man, they like. We we can't do this no more. It's conflicting with our shooting time and our whole day is around this, and we only record for an hour out the day. Dog. Sounds familiar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I ain't trying to start that. <laughs> 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 yeah, I, I ain't trying to start that up in here, but <laughs> but uh, it was like it was like all right, man. Like we could we could stop. If y'all want to stop, we could stop. You know. I ain't know why we stopped, but I want to say a week after we stopped, Spanky Hayes would hit us up from Wildin' Out. And I'm thinking, like, man, Spanky, I ain't really seen Spanky doing nothing for real. Like, he ain't really, we ain't really take no L. That's right. what I'm trying to, not trying, I'm trying to downplay to Spanky. I'm trying to make yeah. myself feel comfortable about not having the show no more. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I'm like, you know what the fuck, it's just Spanky. Like, you know, next week, Spanky. Pull uh, up, Spanky. We uh, doing this shit right now. <laughs> so I had to tell him, like, yeah, we ain't Cold even doing the show no more, bro. <laughs> and he like, man, 
We ain't even say nothing after I told him that. He ain't even say nothing. Then I, uh, a week later, I see him post with Nick Cannon. He had events. I'm like, dog, what the fuck? Like, what's going on, dog? So it was like oh, yeah. after the joke club stuff started to slowly end, we had the that stuff happened with the radio show. Then I ended up getting eliminated from a, a comedy competition that I, I didn't even get to perform at. Like, I was just late because of my niggas that I was with. Like, now you trying to put the full blame on them because I was, was chilling. Like, oh, that's cool. I was chilling too. Yeah, I'm the Monko. Monko. But when I was Four. like, hey, niggas, we got to leave, <laughs> niggas was taking forever to get in the car and go. <laughs> and I got there. It was at uh, my bad. It was at Mark Greeley's Comedy Castle. And it was 10 performers. And if you if you win, you get a trip to Cali, and they was going to uh, – put you on a show at, it was like a big name comedy uh, club in Cali. So I'm like, damn, man, this is the opportunity right here. It's what I've been doing it for. Nigga, get there. They ain't already started. It's a comedian on stage. So I'm like, okay, all right, well, I ain't really too late. <clears throat> I walk to the backstage. They like, uh, yeah, you Jay Rose? <laughs> I'm like, yeah. So he like, yeah, that's supposed to be you upstairs on stage right now. Nah. Like, I'm the first nigga, though. The first one. Like, what's the, you know what I'm saying, the chances of that? So I'm like, what? He like, yeah, let me, you know, let me go check on something real quick. He come back. Yeah, we can't do nothing about it, man. Um, I'm sorry about that. He was the first one. That shit crazy. We don't want to confuse the crowd. Had them mixing up the names of the comedians. They already crossed your name off. Damn. Nigga, when yeah, I say you, fast as hell, man, fast. I, and I only got face. there. I got there <laughs> five minutes late. Like they told you to be there at. It might have been seven. I got there at seven oh five, and it was already on stage doing their thing. Like they was punctual as hell. Everybody can't come up here. <laughs> 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 they was punctual as hell. I ain't never seen them start early on time like that. But that was, that was um, your friend's fault for sure. Man, hell yeah, Shout man. Out Shout out to him. I still love him. Still fuck with him. But, uh, nigga, I almost cried, dog. I went to the bathroom, went in one of them stalls, <laughs> tried to let out some tears. Couldn't even cry. Couldn't even cry. Walked to the car. I didn't even stay for the whole show to see the rest of the performance. Walked to the car, called my niggas like, hey, man, I got eliminated. Bring y'all asses out, man. We, we about to just go to the crib. I ain't even about to. <laughs> I don't niggas, even want to sit in here. Apologize man, these like niggas that. like, man, we got a couple beers. We about to finish these first. Oh then we all God. like, no. Like, <laughs> <laughs> right, nigga, if you don't sit that whole ass beer <laughs> down, <laughs> nigga. Fuck a couple beers. You get your ass out of here. You showed up. We just order a couple beers and shit, you know. Man, bring y'all asses out here, bro. I'm going to the crib, nigga. I ain't trying to. <laughs> Chilling this shit and I I done been eliminated. I ain't about to sit and laugh at some niggas. Man. Like what the fuck? <laughs> I ain't never seen them behave in this manner. <laughs> so man, after that, this is 2017. <laughs> after that, I kind of was like, I'm done with comedy. Like, cause it was like a downhill. Just everything was just falling apart. And I was like, man, this ain't supposed to be like this. I ain't supposed to feel like. You know, all this, uh, taking all these L's, all this pain, like, I'm supposed to be having fun, I'm supposed to be enjoying it, I'm supposed to, you know. So, I just had to sit back, take a um, step back for a second and figure out what I needed to do. And I, I just figured, like, um, basically, uh, the guys that I was doing the comedy group with, their passion isn't comedy. Like they, you know, they joke, everybody joke, we all roast or whatever, but it's not their passion. Sounds so it's not being their passion. Sounds familiar. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, man, I ain't trying to. Uh, nah, 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 that, that, no, that's shots from slaps. Not this, y'all niggas, niggas know who y'all is. If hey. you even listening. <laughs> if you even taking the opportunity. Yeah. And I ain't trying to make it seem like it was all bad with the joke club and everything. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, we had great times doing it, but um, it just, it, it got exhausting. Like I was doing a lot of the editing, 
Um, <laughs> coming up with a lot of you know uh, mm. guests or ideas I for just certain not things. About it, man. <laughs> just and uh, it's crazy. I was just. I'm not laughing at you, bro. We no, 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 I know, I know, I know. I know it's just saying, it's just like, yo, know, it just sounds so familiar. We feel, we feel you, we feel your pain. We feel you. Man, I was just, I was burnt out, man. And then, Sheesh. uh, that's that's how the Airway Jenkins stuff came about, because I had to figure out how can I be funny and do videos on my own mm-hmm. and be creative and still, you know, put out good content. So I came up with the Airway Jenkins character. And then uh, it kind of that, that kind of took off after that. He will bust Spice Adams ass on it. Hell yeah, he will bust Spice Adams. Shout out to Spice. You, you, you did anything with Spice Adams yet? No, everybody was. Uh, you know what? And then I, I kind of got compared to him. Like I want to say about a year or two ago, because when I first started doing it, I didn't even know he was doing a character like that too. And then I started seeing his, and then everybody was tagging like, "Dog, Spice Adams," what's that? but. This is the thing people don't know or don't realize. Like, niggas is not about to just do some shit with you just because you funny. If you ain't got no nothing to benefit them to, mm-hmm. like no following or whatever, they just, you know. It's some people out here that'll put he, you on. He, he'll, he'll, he'll fuck with you because he's from, he from here. So right, right, right. That's okay. Like the, I thought so. Y'all never like really. Yeah, that's like talk the real. Nah, nah. Like I ain't never. I never talked to him. I just I know. I've seen of, some shit. Somebody I, probably I've made some him, shit. I've then. seen him rock with a couple people here that don't have like a crazy following. You know I what I'm saying? It, yeah. Like they, he, if he here, you know right. what I'm saying? Like being in town. I gotta you know. tap in with him then. Yeah, yeah, I just know cool. like off of. Previous experience. Hey, we gonna make it happen. People. Spice Adams, pull up. Yeah. Camera over his, there. His, Spice his, Adams, uh, pull up. His mama go to go to my church. Okay, okay. So like, next time he's down here, she's supposed to let me know, and then we just gonna ambush this nigga. Like we gonna have, <laughs> a, we gonna have a pull up here, and then we're gonna be like, nah, nigga, it's time for skits. Right, 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 <laughs> right, right, right. Thought right, it was right. just the interview, a skit time too, nigga. Yeah. We gonna have nah, a all that shit in here That's already. Man, that <laughs> shit. That, that'd be yeah. her. in here. Yeah, that'd be nah. hilarious, man. That'd be hilarious. Nah, nigga. Hit you that know, nigga man. with the Lindsay Hunter. Yeah, you know. the Gilbert <laughs> Bro, listen, I'm going to tell you straight up. So I told you, I'm going to tell you why I started fucking with this shit heavy, bro. Mm-hmm. Why we fuck with basketball, period. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But the names you compare these movies <laughs> The Tayshawn Smith. Like, it just be, ra- like, I ain't gonna call them random, but it be niggas that <laughs> we fuck with that don't get the shine for real. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's on purpose. That's the whole company like, of it. Like, I, 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 I shit kill me, though, bro. Yeah, I ain't gonna name nobody, like, garbage, but I'm gonna name some niggas that nigga wouldn't name, like, you know. Like you ain't about to shoot a basket and be like Lizzie Hunter. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know. <laughs> <Corliss>. <laughs> yeah, so that's just the that's just the whole comedy of it. And then, you know, the movement and the narration and how I say it or whatever. So It'll be in your bag, dog. Yeah, I appreciate it, man. Do you have a uh you got a bombing story? Yeah, 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 yeah. What? Yeah. We were just talking Come about on, this man. shit, dog. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? Give us, give, give oh, us one. Matter of fact, this is uh Mark Ridley's the same place that I ended up getting eliminated from in seventeen. I started doing comedy in fourteen, in August twenty seventh, two thousand fourteen. My first show was at Mark Ridley's. Um, I had some people come out. It's open mic night. I get down there, I'm nervous as hell. I'm making everybody backstage nervous. Niggas are like, get the fuck away from me, nigga. Like, it's just open mic night. What the fuck is wrong with you? Like, calm down. Go, go do your thing as long as you know your set. Man, I get out there. <coughs> I say my first joke. Everybody laughing. You know, so I get a laugh immediately. I'm like, yeah, okay, bet. Right? Just like you, just like how you say it right now. But I'm saying that on stage, but I'm not talking though. Like, I'm like, hell yeah, we in this big one, you know what I'm saying? (laughs) And it get quiet as hell, cause niggas wanna hear some more. Like, nigga, you on stage, nigga, keep talking. So, (laughs) in my head, I'm like, damn, like, I'm saying my shit, but at the same time, it's so much going on. It's people staring at you like like motherfucker. <laughs> I can't. I, <laughs> I'm like in my head. I'm trying to think about my shit, and then at the same time, I'm like, damn, like this how my voice sound and shit. Like, <laughs> why is it so quiet in this bitch? You know what I'm saying? So, I, uh, I ended up doing two and a half minutes, and uh, got off stage. I was supposed to do five, and I was like, man. 
I just cut, I just cut my sentence short. Like I'm sorry, y'all. Uh, I I forgot my the rest of my set, <laughs> and it was like, oh, <laughs> it was like, oh no, I keep going. I just walked off the stage like the, the host. The host was yo, supposed to like yo. come out and exchange mics with. I down there put the mic back on the stand <laughs> the right way. Took the mic backstage with me, nigga. Like I'm gone. Like I, I, this is embarrassing. Bro, I could never. I think do I, that I, shit. It's the top, bro. Five, top five shit. hardest jobs. Oh, bro, After that, bro, like, mu- music is so different because like you can at least catch niggas with the beat. Even you if can niggas, have fun. Even up if there. niggas ain't paying attention to you performing, you still get in your bag and shit. Like you don't, you care, but because you having a good time up there. So it's like, and then people it. don't realize how that's silly that's they silence. look when. <laughs> When they concentrating and they try, they looking at you and they listening to what you gotta say, like people be looking silly as hell. Like you be looking at people like, dog, why is you looking so serious and so concentrating on loosen up a little bit, like, cause you fucking me up now. Like, oh, you got the serious ass stern face. Like, dog, I just remember that episode of Fresh Prince when Will thought he could be a with DL Hughley dog. They was on Will Smith's ass and that shit. And Carlton whole ass was in the crowd booing that nigga dog. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the Jada oh, hugged up with Pac somewhere. It's just going oh, for okay, dog. that's what we doing. <laughs> that's what we doing. Toxic it's Jada. How you feel about that, man? Dog. Good segue, real quick. Man, I ain't got nothing to say about that, man. Cause I. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Will Smith might see this one day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but <laughs> he's going to. You just got to hold this L, nigga. You ain't August. Shit. Yeah, what you got to hold this L, L man. man. I just feel like, damn. <laughs> that's the Fresh Prince, bro. Mm-hmm. Like, how you do the Fresh Prince like that, Jada? Corey. I get the fuck on. See, I don't. <laughs> hey, we don't know, though. That's we ain't that's never met him. We don't Will, know that's how. That's Will Smith. <laughs> but it's like I don't do do relationships just fizzle out. I mean, start they jumping do. out of like buildings, they and swimming with sharks, and just doing a lot of like. Okay, let's move on. Shit. Let's move on. Yeah, let's we can get, get into this for like let's thirty minutes. Let's get back. I don't got time for this nigga. We shit. can get in. <laughs> we can get into that, nigga. This nigga will just turn into a <laughs> completely <laughs> different person. <bro. laughs> Jada, like what the, swimming with sharks. What? <laughs> J- waking up, think, think, w- rolling over every day, and it's a fucking uh, motivational speech next to you every morning. You waking up, <laughs> <laughs> she ain't trying to hear. I'm trying to get fucked. <laughs> I'm not trying to hear none of that shit you talking about, Will. Yo, shut the fuck up, dog. Let's, let's lock back in. Stupid. <laughs> I ain't trying to hear that shit. Oh he said God. motivational he said speech shit, in the morning, though. Time, dog. <laughs> you see, fear doesn't exist. The only thing, like, all right, nigga. Damn, yeah. August, come I'm, here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Come if, here he, August, if you're around the crib, <laughs> I mean, if all, you're around the crib like that, like, to day, day, I, I feel jaded. Yeah, 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 like, nigga, Augie. Oh, Augie. Yeah, Augie. I was going to take that nigga. Uh, Face and put that nigga on the uh, Mike Lewin and Og. Remember the Nickelodeon show? I was gonna put that nigga on there, but I ain't think enough niggas remember the show, so I just let that shit. I, nah, I, I know, and if that's, that would have been it. You would have been like the one, like you know, what I'm saying Miles would have came and laughed. That would that would have been all I got. Probably so. <laughs> that would have been all I got, bro. Um, niggas fuck with the stupid shit. You did security before? Yeah, how you know? I mean, I seen the moves Ooh, on this nigga on that. On that. <laughs> <laughs> oh. no. miles on his, I got hey, his hot one shit. Hey, that's how that hot ones nigga be. They be like, how the fuck? Been <laughs> doing your research. Hey, this nigga. <laughs> no, I actually got a funny ass guardian story, bro. You did security for fun? No, I'm saying you had the whole security fit on. I did there, have. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I did have. It. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because I ain't had no costume at first when I did that video. You but was uh, that mannequin ass shit. I'm like, okay. <laughs> get the fuck <laughs> no, shout out to Northwest Activity Center. Nigga had the karate mm-hmm. classes as a kid back in the day. Talk about it. So, you know, a nigga could get his ass. Like, no, but, uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, dog, I, had, I got a funny ass story, dog. I was doing Guardian at Enterprise where you, you know, mm-hmm. rent the cars and shit. Nigga, the whole reason why I'm there is because this white lady, a nigga came in that bitch and slapped the shit out this white lady <laughs> oh, behind the counter, over the counter, I mean. Because she was denying him his rental. Mm-hmm. And I don't know what the dispute was about, but 
he ended up slapping her ass almost knocked out and then the employees had to like help her. There's a white guy, right? Yeah. I can't. Yeah, 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 white guy, yeah, white guy, <laughs> white guy. <laughs> and then uh, <laughs> he basically uh, slapped her and she called the police and then he called back later. He got away, but he called up there later like, yeah, this ain't over. So. <laughs> 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 so she like I, I guess the police was like well we could you know assign somebody up there or call somebody so i don't know how it worked out but you know they got me to go up there it ain't over motherfucker. man the whole time i'm up there i'm like man if this nigga come in here and slap her ass again i'm not doing shit <laughs> <laughs> these niggas got me fucked up nigga for eleven dollars <laughs> to fuck, I'm not about to scrap no nigga for her ass. Like, especially if he calling and coming back, that's a dangerous man, right there. Man, he what? don't give no fucks. Yeah, it ain't over. It yeah, ain't over. you done already smacked. <laughs> they had me walking the perimeter and shit. Like she, uh, man, I don't know, dog. That shit was just crazy. But, uh, so how did this character come about? Oh, so Terry Maxwell. I all right. It's kind of like a. I'm gonna make a short story. But my homeboy had been bought the mannequin. And uh I thought it was funny because we all used to live together at one at one point in time, you know, on just trying to do the skit shit or whatever. But uh ended up doing no skits by the way. But uh <laughs> we <laughs> we had he had the mannequin in the basement where we was you know wash the clothes at. So as soon as you come around the corner, it scared everybody because he just standing there like you think it's a nigga in the crib. So I'm dying laughing after after it scared the shit out of me. And then one day he put some clothes on that nigga. <laughs> scared us again. Like made him taller, put some clothes on. I'm like, bro, <laughs> chill the fuck out, bro. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you? So I just thought about an idea to do the skit. And I just didn't have the idea all the way put together. And what's crazy is we we weren't even gonna do that skit at first because it was running out of daylight. And my man was like, bro, you've been talking about this skit for forever. Just pull up do the shit. I ain't had an idea finished or nothing. We ended up improv, I ended up improv basically the whole skit. And that was like my biggest skit out of everything I did really? so far. That's the biggest one as far as like, <laughs> views <on. coughs> yeah. okay. as far as like views. And uh, well, I'm lying, yeah, I'm lying. It was some joke club stuff on Instagram that did like 50,000, 40,000 views. Yeah, uh, that shit oh, feels good. Yeah, 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 never yeah, seen yeah, them yeah, type yeah. of numbers, nigga. Oh, no. Forty, yeah, yeah, forty views. 50. Yeah, it, it 50, felt. Oh, 50. He said forty, oh. fifty. Oh. Yeah, we, we was playing thousand. And that's that's. I was, I was saying forty for us. Oh. Just <laughs> <laughs> that's a fact. That's a max. Good I said forty. I said, oh, we hit fifty. <laughs> okay, <laughs> niggas doing good. Yeah. And that that was another going back to like when the joke club started ending. It's like as soon as we hit like we had hit a uh, 10k followers on Instagram, and it was like that was kind of like our goal to like try to hit 10k or whatever. And it was like once we hit 10k, everybody just started falling off, not meeting up on time. That's for, crazy. Celebrities, bro. We gonna turn into celebrities. We feeling it good. I'm gonna want more. Yeah, so okay, let's go from David Ruff and Bobby 000. Brown, all type of fucking man. egos. Ralph, Tra- go crazy. Yeah, man. So um, the Terry Maxwell on Facebook ended up doing like fifteen thousand views, that's true, that's and uh, that's why I was trying to top it with the second one. But somebody pointed out to me, I was talking to my homeboy, I, I told him, you know, the same story I told y'all. I was like, man, I tried to top the second one, I had everything planned out. Mm-hmm. He was like, man, that's what you're doing wrong. Like, you just trying, to trying too hard. Like, yeah. you planning it way too hard with the first one. You was, you know, it was just easy. You just doing your thing, it was improv. You just had the basic idea. And that's what you gotta really do, just it's do it. It's crazy that life is like that, though. Mm-hmm. Us as creators, we do that all the time. Facts. You mm-hmm. know, it's just like, ah, oh, I need to, I instead of just this. enjoying yeah. what you're doing and letting niggas mm-hmm. kind of like gravitate to it, we just try to. That's because yeah, you go back and you and watch high. it, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? When mm-hmm. you watch, like, even last night, bro, I watched our first episode probably six, seven that shit, times. That shit's bro. a classic, though. Facts. Like the audio and visuals, and I'm is just really terrible, trying to pinpoint. But okay. it's really like a good, 
it was it was, it was good. Great. It was fun. It was a bro. great feeling, bro. Yeah. You ever watch yourself on TV? Uh, talking about like YouTube wise. Yeah, yeah. Like throw that shit on the smart yeah, TV. Yeah, 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 yeah. All the time, all the time. Like, uh, like it's BET. <laughs> I felt, hey, I felt like I thought I was on. Hey, see the Tyler Perry Listen, productions 50, come stop up. Stop playing yeah. with us and put us on stars, bro. Yeah. Tyler yeah, Perry yeah. productions come up before that shit. You're like, yeah, nigga, we made it. Yo, yo, fuck yo, it, yo. you know I don't even fuck with you, but Tyler Perry, pull up too. Shit, <laughs> <laughs> we'll make it work. Shit. You see, we got our own oh, shit yeah, right oh now. My God. Watch the bit of you guys' content. <laughs> oh, we out. <laughs> That shit not gonna last with Tyler Perry at all. <laughs> you gonna have to work the compound fields a little bit. <laughs> Reek, nigga, we gonna have to work that shit off. <laughs> mm-hmm. with this thing Niggas gonna be trying to get Zay away to work with us and shit. We straight. Fact. Get out of here. <laughs> oh, pi- <laughs> podcast magic. We back. Potter. We back. Now man. we Shout Shouts to D Wade, man. Shouts to D Wade, man. Shouts to any of y'all niggas out there that just you know be want to be like. <laughs> goals and you know, <laughs> and then, you know, get a little Gabby oh, Union behind you. Oh you know, gosh, anybody that want to do that. Not my cup of tea, but hey. All right, so let, let's pod a little bit real quick. I mean, we go do like ten more minutes real quick. Real. You watch basketball, correct? Say we chilling, and we say, "Damn, number fifteen going crazy right now, bro." And mm-hmm. You tweet that. Is anything wrong with that? Yeah, uh, number fifteen is a woman, though. Number fifteen? <laughs> is there anything wrong with saying number fifteen going crazy? Yeah, no, and we watching it. and we watching uh We basketball. watching that right now. And we just tweeted. I don't know. I don't think okay. so. Do you feel like we need to Google this this person's number, like Google the name before we post that? Uh no, not really. I don't okay. know. No, I mean, cause you in the moment. You just like, man, mm. you know. In the fucking moment, Craig. <laughs> <laughs> can't think straight. You can't yeah, think straight in the heat of the moment. I can't think straight in the heat of the moment. So, you, I, I, so, so let's go ahead and break it down. So, so what? So what happened, man? Andre Iguodala was watching the WNBA, uh, obviously showing his full support uh, for women in sports and enjoying it okay. much more than I would do. Okay. All right. So he watched. He said, "Yo, number twenty-three on the Mystics is nice." Number 23 on the Mystics, who is uh, R.E.L. Powers from Detroit. <laughs> Got to put that in there. From right. Detroit, snaps on this nigga and said, put some respect on my name or keep this tweet. <laughs> so he doesn't reach back out to her. He just says, dot, 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 no manners. <laughs> Which I was my nigga Reg. He said, these hoes have no manners. Is what the three dots is what the three dots shit, were. Shit, really? So the three dots was these hoes. Okay, go crazy. Yeah, so that's what <laughs> Oh, have no manners. That's what. That's what. That's what. Uh, you know. That's what he said. Would go in that blank. Um. So she was upset, and you know, she went on a rant. Like you know, we we tired of being disrespected and marginalized. Um. As a basketball player, you should, you know, know to say our name. You know, people don't be paying attention to us much, and it's just like. Okay, I I, I thought know. y'all was saying like, yeah. see, that's different, nigga. Oh, like, is come it, on, now. Uh, is, is it? it? I feel like I feel like I feel like that's I feel like that I feel like that's different because nigga, you a damn ain't he a damn sports analyst now? I'm I'm watching TV. We watching TV though, huh? I'm on Twitter. I'm watching TV. I'm just tweeting. Wait, who tweet? This is Nigga Dollars at home and he just tweeted. He's watching the game. Yeah, he's at home. But yeah, still, you Andre Iguodala. He a human being. He you was tweeting, man. So hell you just, no. Okay, go ahead. Let man, me hear. On a on a, profe- on a professional. Okay, let's go. Don't change on it. Pro- on a professional level, because that's I Which mean that's not your. do that shit all the time. Hold huh? on, let them let him get this shit yeah. rock. So go ahead, man. Ahead. I, they it ain't right. Even if you do it all the time, it ain't right. But it's because it's like I don't know. It's, you Andre Iguodala. You in the NBA? Y'all almost colleagues, damn near. Mm-hmm. Y'all peers, basically. Y'all just. In a different league or whatever, but you can't just so say he, it like it's a high, like you watching a high school game or something Googled like that. It. Yeah, he definitely should do his research and seeing who she was. <laughs> ain't nobody Y'all about like, to do that. Cause you, I, I mean, if it's just <laughs> us, if it's a regular nigga, if it's a regular nigga, hell yeah, yeah I would be like, hey, twenty. I don't know who the fuck she is. Would you have it's, react like her? No, no, no. She, <laughs> I mean, she ain't have to. 
She ain't have to say all that. That's she what ain't I'm saying. I ain't, I ain't got like, no problem with her feeling like that. No, that's what I said. We, yeah, yeah that's a feeling. The way you reacted was just like, all right, bro. She was pissed off. Just, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let me ask another question. Don't nobody even know what the fuck the Mystics is. So he would have been like, all right, your powers from the Mystics. I'm like, I was kept scrolling. Who is that? I don't even know what he's talking about. Like, so, what right, the fuck right. is he so Steph Curry about? tweets. He he posted this uh this player's that stats. Shit hilarious, dog. And she got off. I think she almost had a triple double. He put sheesh. Somebody reply. She's not a sheesh. Say her name. Her name was in the her in name the stats. was in the stat. Okay. Sorry. Now that's that's you know. She's not a sheesh. Come on now. People doing too much. That's that's some shit like, come on now. You just picking for shit now. <laughs> why you, why you, why you just trying that hard to find some shit wrong with him? Like a tweet where he say she's like they can't say she's like damn. Women have been uh picking with 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 shit lately. Oh, I'm gonna find, find this. I'm gonna find this post to read. I'm trying to think. Do you really want to take it there? Because I was confused. I'll be confused about a lot of yeah, shit they post now. Uh, feel about. <laughs> <Dang>. <laughs> See how you feel about this as soon as I find it. You know what? We ain't even got to find it. I would generalize this. Uh, a white woman said, fellas, oh, if. Oh, you, yeah. yeah. Fellas, if uh, you are accused of rape, even if you did not do it, you should take the blame for it because if there are so many countless women who have not had justice and have been marginalized and disrespected through history to where you guys can take that hit for us. Fuck, no, thank what? you. Yeah. No. Like, what? It was ridiculous. I was waiting on a woman to agree. I see no. Nobody not did. One. Yeah, nobody not did. One. What? But it's a few people who comment on my shit generally and ain't said nothing. So I gotta it's assume to you guys say. agree. Nah. Nah, why you ain't come why you, you are hey, why you ain't got an opinion on this? Hey, hey, go get caught go get caught in the crossfire. You better come say something. <laughs> <laughs> Do you all agree? Hey, go tag him. Right. Why y'all ain't saying shit? Y'all say shit anywhere else. Even even if you know you didn't do it. Yeah. Like what yeah, the fuck? Uh-huh. Somebody take else better take, 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 take the blame then. I ain't about to take the blame for that shit. You better find somebody else to take the blame for that shit. The fuck? It's been a lot. Um, that shit ridiculous. Let me ask how you guys feel about this. It's been a lot of uh, we don't protect black women, and I'm. This is me talking. This is this is slap talk. It's nobody else's view. <laughs> if I'm leaving out the grocery store, and you and your man's getting into an argument, you smack the fuck out you, right? <laughs> No, generally, I'm just laughing. generally, <laughs> you know what I'm sorry, I'm back, sorry. generally back in like what I'm the sorry. 20s I'm and sorry. shit. Like I might, you know, like I, like if I'm with my man, so I'm be like, man, let's go over here and you know see what's going on. Like, try to, the 20s, try to calm, try to try to calm dude down. Like 1925. Man. No, no, I'm talking about like in my 20s. Oh, oh, oh okay. Go so like man, right man. now, yo, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna Mind alert you, someone. I'm gonna alert someone, yeah. like you know, alert somebody in the store, call the cops. I ain't getting involved. I got two kids to get to the crib too. I'm not trying to come. Hey, bro, calm down. Get shot. Now I'm dead. Get shot. Hey, bro, calm down. Now I'm knocked out. This nigga Mike Tyson or something. Now I'm fucking laid out on the floor, going viral. Hey man, I, I don't have. At time. least you support it. I don't have time for none of that it shit. It was there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So like they like. Is women, this always the scenario? Women though? feel like you, like if you see some shit like that happening, like step in, and it's only certain times that I'll step in. We got to be at like Disney World, where I know you ain't got no weapon. And shit, remember that video there? I'd have stepped in that. Shit, dog was going crazy. He was on the rampage. That nigga was punching like a bitch. <laughs> no, that's a fact. But that people. nigga was mad. I was <laughs> laying out. I was old really people. confused. Why but if he somebody so would have went over and been like, bro, like if if a bunch of people would have told that's him, that's probably to chill. one of the best places in this damn country, bro. It's like if what if, if a bunch about? of people would have came, like, bro, come on, chill out, chill out, or say it, or say it, chill out, but. It's only certain times I'm gonna step in. You, that bro. shit right there, we at the grocery the store. I'm like, you, man, I'm just open carry. I'm, man, I'm straight. Okay, yeah, man. I'm like, shit, I'm good. Fuck I'm good. That. My thing is, bitch. is I that can't. always the case, bro? What, that we don't protect? As far as the feel like, because I feel like they be saying a bunch of shit, and I'm just like, I don't feel like it's nobody else's place. Um, a lot of the shit they be, you put yourself in those relationships. Facts. You know what I'm saying? And then it's been plenty of times where I step in and then you be right back with the nigga the next day. <laughs> Talk about it. Mm-hmm. So I ain't gonna lie, man. Yeah, I can't I, I can't 
I, I, now I could support from the back end. And, right. You know, we can always do that. You know, we can we can say no to domestic violence and all that shit. But as far as like just stepping in physically, I can't do that. I ain't gonna lie, man. Even if I witness some shit like that, I ain't see it. Like I'm just turning <laughs> the cheek. I'm just turning the other cheek, bro. Cause it's, it's especially de- depending on the velocity of the slap. Like how hard, <laughs> how hard did this nigga just slap you? Cause if that nigga slapped the shit out you, like down there slapped your neck off your shoulders, I'm in the car. I'm in like I'm gone. You know what I'm saying? Call the police. Nah, I ain't about to call the boy. I ain't seen nothing. Hey man, if it, I'm gonna act like it, I ain't seen and, nothing. And women, if it helps, man, I mean, black men don't step in for black men when they getting, you know what I'm saying, fucked up either, bro. I was leaving, I was leaving school the other day, bro. This chick, this chick was throwing shit from the patio and the projects, chairs, a chair hit this nigga. She came out with like a little mini table, threw that bitch out. I'm just like, I, cannot I was just looking like, on this show, damn. Just got in the car. This, like, this is definitely a forecast. Hey, I'm like, this, shit, shit. this nigga, bro. It's other people. Call mom's like, man. bro. I just. <laughs> this nigga like, got hit with a chair, a mini table. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody's doing anything. I drove off. I, I think I, I think didn't we, even alert the authorities. They got my mouth. This next time you see a woman or a female post that, bro, tell them we gotta pull up because I, I do. We just talked about this last episode, and I really want to get to the bottom of this shit. I would need to talk with a level-headed Facts. woman. I don't want to be on this bitch. Like, you don't either. You had already said that about a couple people. Oh, yeah, facts. Like, you like, I don't want them in here because they just want to argue. They just want to talk. Agree, and I got to agree. Like, I get people want to uh, hear y'all, have a voice, but you got to hear y'all into things. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But uh, We here to help. Yeah, you Not bad. Help so I need you to understand. Yeah. Yes. It's ridiculous, but yeah, we can't always, you know, step in physically. But we can back you all up, man. On sidelines, I'm days over. Got our real powers on, but yeah, just jumping in some shit. Who back us though? I'm, I'm not getting blasted, bro. Niggas are shooting niggas at the drop of a fucking hat. Mm-hmm. If I make a so, post right now <laughs> for saying, saying anything, hey, bro, chill out, nah, nigga, you chill the fuck out mm-hmm. <laughs> before you can even chill the fuck out. You sorry, your bullet, already bullet through you. Like I, and another thing too, can't. my man's did that shit, bro. He went to jail. Who? My man's got into some shit because he seen tried to break him up, wind yeah. up scrapping the yeah. dude, and he went to jail. And they didn't go; they went home. Man, mm. that's some mm. shit like yeah. that. Shit like this that. This was a minute like ago that. too. Exactly. I just thought about that like shit. That. Dog went to jail and they went home together. That's some bullshit. That's why you just mind your business, even if you seen some shit, fellas. When you see some shit like that, just you ain't see shit. To I'll tell call, yourself I'll you call, I'll call that. somebody. That's it. Yo, I just saw some shit going on. The sec- they got securities out. at the store. Yeah, I'm heading out. Security ain't doing nothing. Look, he already said he let, he let the. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> hey, <laughs> it ain't over. I'm thinking like tomorrow. shit. I'm straight, nigga. I ain't fucking around with this Look shit. Look at Craig yeah. and Dede. I feel you. It's like Look at Craig and Dede. Not putting Niggas myself running arms through the way, nigga. Yeah. I'm step in and get shot. Now, now I got fatherless children. You, I you club, alive back with the nigga? Why club securities <laughs> don't work at like stores? Like why they shit? They be trying to whoop everybody. I ass never go to the store. Right. Fuck around, drop some rice, and been and got stumped. <laughs> out of Man, head. what? I'm just saying they be on tip at the club like that. I Maybe swear. they should be the niggas that's working at these you lots. That fucking shit. apple next to the tomato. Like, oh, my bad. Like them niggas. I'm like, just, like, sir, them you niggas want, be on tip. Sir, you want to remove that sleeve of club crackers off the talking man? Like, damn, nigga, how you know? Oh, I'm straight. Is bro. you drinking this fucking water and you ain't paid for it yet? <laughs> oh, shit. I'm straight, bro. No, them niggas don't need to work oh, there, bro. Man. That shit will be a whole nother shopping experience at Kroger. <laughs> Imagine the seeing the nigga get thrown. You walking in, man, the seeing they get thrown, like, over Throw a nigga's basket, <laughs> though. Like, yeah. Roll the basket. <laughs> Put a nigga in a basket and roll that bitch out. <laughs> oh, that's some shit, right. bro. They really be beating the shit. Shit out of niggas out here, bro. Uh, remember that bro, shit, was, dog? Bro, Woody's and Royal Oak used to beat the fuck out. No, of remember when they first listened? The when out the world opened thing. back up, do y'all remember that footage at the um, what's the strip club on Eight Mile going east? Fifty shit. Fuck truth. Mm-hmm. Y'all ain't see that video? Yeah, when security know. was beating the fuck out this, like bashing this nigga shit on the bar. Damn, are y'all serious? Maybe <laughs> Damn, Damn, this is this was probably like the first opening. <laughs> Damn, when did this shit open back up? I don't know. Uh, the world, 
June. <laughs> it was June. Dog. It was that like first weekend, bro. I ain't see that shit. White dude beating dog ass, <laughs> slamming his shit on the bar. I've never time. seen no shit like that, bro. They be telling them shit. niggas, there's no A. Ain't no rules. Go crazy. But ain't not. Oh, fuck. Mm-hmm. Yeah, y'all security guards be tripping. That's so, a man, you want to shout anybody out, man? What's coming? You got anything coming up? Um, Yeah, as far as... uh. Well, I was, you know, I'm still going hard with the skits. Got more Elroy Jenkins stuff he coming. He in love now. Yeah, he in love now. Okay. So everybody been asking for like a little series. <laughs> so I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to put together a series. I, I don't like doing you make stuff. a short film. I seen that shit. Like yeah, that. <laughs> yeah, man. I don't, I don't know. I, I'm gonna try. It could be like twelve minutes, you know, like twelve. Yeah, film? I got yeah, somebody that could, that uh, that can help with that too. I don't watch the nigga twelve Trump minutes trying shorts. to do some shit like. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we can definitely so 12 uh, short, ship it down to Atlanta. See what Tyler yeah. Perry. Tyler Perry compound <laughs> feel about it. <laughs> hey, Medea hey, could be in this shit if you want to, bro. Just pay me. <laughs> hey, just pay me. You put her in the scene. Yeah. Fuck it. Get Brown out there and some hoops. That shit. nigga ready. Yeah. <laughs> I Tyler Perry Perry ready to, right. He ready to throw that motherfucking dress up or something. I had kind of been Medea's skeptical back about it. Alive. Just a while. See, he ready, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm I'm gonna do it though. I have been skeptical about it because I I don't like doing stuff that's super super long. Mm. Like I feel like the, the attention span of a person, especially when you post it on social media, you it. probably only got about three seconds to capture somebody's attention. If your video ain't did nothing in three seconds, they scrolling. Mm-hmm. So all my my style is like immediately as soon as it cut on, it has to be comedy right away, right yeah. you know right away, and. uh I could do 12 minutes just to see, you know, put it out there. Try I gotta it out, try man. it out. I gotta try it out. Yeah, see what's up. I gotta try it out. We might get Uncle Drew to pull up. Right, right, right. <laughs> hey, bro. Yeah, I, gotta, I gotta try <laughs> yeah, it out. You I definitely gotta try it out. Listen, I shot Kyrie ass out all, on every oh. episode. But, hey, I'm telling you, that's what bag I'm in. No, I'm in. You with the beard. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you, oh, yeah, yeah that's what I'm saying. You with the beard, bro. That shit'll be funny. That's what I'm this shit up. Put that shit Mr. Seal Your Nana. Yeah, pull up, bro. Let's do a skit, bro. Steal your name. Okay, okay. Let's do a skit. Yeah, we do it. And our coach too. Yeah, we can make some shit happen. <laughs> <laughs> Let's make some shit happen. Oh, sure. that shit'll be funny as hell. Yeah, yeah. y'all can y'all can get in y'all bag with that shit for sure. But yeah, other than other than the short film and um, skit stuff, I've been getting into camera work, doing photography now, videography work, trying to learn and get better with that. I ain't think I was gonna enjoy doing that, but that's been fun. Mm-hmm. But again, uh, doing like taking pictures at events, and um, I did my friend birthday party. Uh, you know, a little uh, video for her, or whatever. Oh so, shit, you did that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah. shit was clean as hell. I appreciate it. Uh, appreciate, it, yeah, yeah. And uh, so, you doing any stand up soon or? Uh, what do you, what do you what you like better? That's 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 the question I got. The skits or? I just like I just like comedy in general. Without my main goal, I want to do like either a TV show or like just be in movies doing comedy. Okay, stand up. I love stand up, but I might put stand up second to acting type stuff like okay. skits or whatever. Yeah, yeah. But I like the skits and acting more than. Uh, I can see the TV show popping off though. Yeah, I, yeah no, I hope so. Duh. Hopefully, I like like TV shows, and skits and shit. Oh shit, man, what, areas, what happened to the Carmichaels, bro? Mm, that, was that was my fucking show. That was, that was a really good show, and mm. I feel like it's a lot of people that don't know about that yeah. shit. Dog. I that caught onto it yeah. late. He's actually funny as fuck. Cracks top ten for sure. <laughs> <laughs> what? Gerard, Carmichael, he in your he in your top ten. Carmichael? Yeah, he there. He there. Look at that. That's crazy. That? Come on, man. The Carmichael's is fucking hilarious, man. I'm put him, put him, put him up. Get, put some respect on that nigga name, pull man. Pull up like that. Oh yeah. Put some respect on his name, bro. I didn't even see that. You just did this. This was here probably. What's the date on that shit? Man, you get the Sometime. short film popping. Oh no, we young. I think we true. Can, that's why I said true. Yeah. Trying to do short. You get films. the short film popping. I think we could do like a little small, intimate screening in the other room, like yeah, thirty facts, people. Thirty people. Get some feedback. Had niggas ask some questions, just on some like. I think that should be, be dope. a dope little 
Hell yeah. Talk a little spill. Yeah, yeah. We're definitely going to lock yeah, in on some shit. Yeah, get some shit like this that going. Like, that'll be fire. Let's go. Like, that'll be fire for sure. Yeah, I'm going to pull up just like this, though. <laughs> <laughs> Call <laughs> Kyrie <laughs> ass out. <laughs> yeah, we going with we come with funny Low key, ass you can't because think about it, bro. Kyrie made a whole movie off his little, um, what was it, like eight minute joints? Act- actually, a oh, decent, yeah, yeah. actually, a decent film, too. I enjoyed that movie. But yeah. I'm saying the skits before that. Though. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Which is, I'm kind of mad about because it's like the, the scenes on the commercials was way colder than the scenes in the movie. And I'm oh, like, facts. I knew that yeah. was going to happen. Yeah. Though. But why? Why does it happen like I, that? I, I, I Hollywood. When Hollywood. the budget, the budget in Hollywood is way, way bigger more. than Kyrie, Kyrie ain't go out there and suck no dick. Uh, that's a fact. Yeah, that's what happened. That's oh, you, oh, you not sucking dick out here? Bet. Okay, ten thousand. Yeah, yeah, here, <laughs> you do, yeah. here you go, <laughs> Uncle <laughs> Drew. Go get yeah. this uh, that nigga, <laughs> nah, that. the visuals was way better. Like that Miami, that nigga would have did that was shit. So fire, bro. That's all like, what he did with Reggie Miller was crazy as hell. Cause who was doing the commercials? Pepsi or Pepsi? Pepsi should have did the movie. Pepsi. Damn there. <laughs> that shit is weird, bro. But. Yeah, that's that's the ultimate goal, dog. Just to we just set it up, do some <laughs> movies, man. We got, we about to shoot the movie. Mm-hmm. We claimed it. Yeah, hell yeah, man. Yeah. Any shout outs you want to uh? Uh, shout out to G Mac Cash, man, okay. who been doing his thing. He hit me up. He want to do a skit. We just ain't uh got the day right, the time. Don't get you some so you know who that be. Uh. Another guy, comedians that uh, I like from here, comedian CP, John Bell, who's always you know <clears throat> he like a big part of uh, my career and stuff. A lot, you know, how I do stuff with stand up and all that. And um, who else was I gonna say, man? I can't forget about um, what's dog name that opened up for Tim City. I can't remember his name, but he fucking hilarious, dog. Dog funny as hell. Uh, fuck. I, I, I was, I was it, wait, when I see, I, I, yeah. I know what he looked like and shit, but I cannot remember this nigga name. Yeah, but he funny. funny shit, he funny bro. every time I see his ass. Uh, and that Mike Larry. Fuck. fuck. My boy Mike Larry. Uh, what's the dude that what's, what's my man's that be rapping and shit? That's G-Mac, ain't it? Not, oh, not rapping for real, but e- like. E-boy, uh, E boy crazy yeah, or E boy? Um, I think that's something. Yeah, that nigga pretty funny. Yeah, E boy funny as hell. Yeah, he um, pretty funny, bro. Uh, Donnie comedy, y'all follow? Yeah. Donnie, yeah. Oh, yeah, Donnie he, he pulled up before. He yeah, went yeah, to yeah, stay yeah. with us. Oh, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I fuck with him. Yeah, his shit funny as that hell. That motherfucking fight video funny as hell. That nigga did. He just dropped one for his uh, wedding. Shit. That one, yeah, that was funny as hell. Yeah, yeah. That was funny. His shit. He just, you know, he just got married. Nah, man. And he uh, did like a, what was it? A, a happy, happily ever after. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For all how, the characters. <laughs> <and shit. laughs> how, <laughs> like how a movie. gotta watch that shit. How a hood movie would end at the if yeah, it nah, had No, niggas just be up in, up in <laughs> marriage and doing COVID, nigga. I'm just saying, like, Facts. fucking 20 people That's just get married. Up, Cause yeah. I thought niggas was gonna kind of hold back. I would have not like it. You get married, bro? Here, buddy. Man. <laughs> Not no time soon, no time man. Soon. We wait, nigga. Take your time. <laughs> Take your time. Yeah, man. Not no time soon, man. Shout, out, shout out to the wife, man. Oh, you married? How long you been married for? Man, no, four years. How you how you like it, man? It's it's the same. It's the same. <laughs> <laughs> hey, and that's, that's how it be. That's, real shit. that's how it be for the niggas. Like that's after the marriage, it's like we come home and it's like. Hey, same man, shit as same usual, shit. but Just the more, women man. more responsibilities. <laughs> nigga lied yeah. on camera. Yeah, <laughs> this nigga lied on camera. Wow, this nigga lied on camera. Just a tad bit more stressful than it was. Before. <laughs> you ain't keeping it professional. So. Hey, nigga, sprinkle hey. a little bit of stress on top. <laughs> like, yeah. keep the, my shit definitely was he more stressful the train, before. The train the answer, like, <laughs> yeah, it's definitely more. It stressful. It was more stressful <laughs> before. Trust me. You know, me. me and my girl, we got my wife. We got this. And I love her. She loved me. Man, listen, good. my life was crazy before I got married. That shit was way more stressful before the marriage. Really? Facts. We we gonna talk off cam. <laughs> <laughs> we ain't we gonna talk no, about I'll cap. T- I keep it real on this bitch. She, she, hey, no, don't fuck, start fuck with this. That. This is cap. This is cap. <laughs> Put one of a, di- a digital cap on me right in the edits. <laughs> Put the Terry Crews MAGA Terry boy Cruz in it. <laughs> Shout out to Trump. Ah, <laughs> shit, <laughs>
Oh, anyways, anybody excited about the second stimulus? Let's change the subject real quick. Hey, uh, wait, it's another stimulus? Yeah, they, I they didn't even hear about it. that. Huh? Yeah, they they working on it. It's coming. We just don't know when. Probably See, October. that's what I'm saying, man. We don't even know for sure though. Shit. They ain't they ain't saying nothing for sure for sure man, though. Them niggas drop that bitch around uh, PS5 and Xbox time. Niggas will niggas will be happy as hell. No, he's back in office. Hey, hey, he's back in. Yeah. Got my boy. Right <laughs> Thank Damn. you, sir. Oh, hey, yeah. I was sitting next to Kanye. Like, hello. Go <laughs> get a cap. Do my unboxing in the MAGA cap. Hey. Like, hey, nigga. <laughs> games on. Man. I was just talking to you my man about that. Ah, games on crack. That should be great. I was talking about my man's uh, talking to my man's about that the other day. He was like, uh, if, no, I was I was telling him like, man, if Trump. Give us our reparations or whatever, though. Nigga, what? I'm who first got, nigga in line at the polls, nigga. Who like, got, who got that shit? I got my North Trump fitted on everything. Like, they nigga. talks of things that aren't uh, liquid assets. So, shit like uh, that they think we need. Did y'all uh, hear anything about the tax? They shit? had a list that black people didn't come up with, and the black folk was like, "Nah, let me tell you what we want." <laughs> they <laughs> like, came up with a list. Say, Thank you. I Take thought, that. I, yeah. thought, I heard people was like, "Yeah, we yeah. want uh, three hundred thousand a piece." No. <laughs> What the fuck is that? Yeah, ain't gonna get, yeah, they ain't gonna I get that. It. I take it. But they I take it. They're not giving 300000 a piece. <laughs> everybody, everybody that's 18 and up? That's nuts, nigga. Maybe it's, maybe it's to one household. China going to own us. They were struggling to give us fucking 12. Maybe it's 300000 to one household. Could that work? No. Man, give me a and crib mine, in yeah. Africa. And, and yeah, move me to Africa <laughs> with Wi Fi. There, and I'm yeah. straight. <laughs> and a flight there. Give me to the Akon best Wi Fi in the world in the house, and I'm straight. Man, let this nigga Akon be like, hey, the city's open. Whoever. He, he, man, Akon pack everything. We out. But Akon nigga. fucked up with Takashi, so I don't trust him. So man. he fucked me up with that shit. <laughs> I'm not <laughs> going to Africa no more. And I was big voucher for Akon. I'm there, nigga. Doing locked up with Takashi. Takashi ain't going to be able to come. You're right. I'm gonna have a hyena <laughs> waiting on his ass. Mm-hmm. A bamboo and a fucking hyena. Getting busy in that bitch. We about to sign up, man. Go ahead, give him all your uh, Instagram, social medias. Oh, uh, Comedian J Rose on Instagram. Facebook, Comedian J Rose. Um, you can still follow the Joke Club. Sometimes we might surprise y'all and drop a new skit. So oh. it's the joke. It's, spicy, <laughs> it's the joke. <laughs> <laughs> get y'all oh loose. The joke club. The joke club. TV on Instagram, <laughs> and uh, follow my new uh, photography page, Roseway Portraits. All different bags. Yeah, man. Trying. Oh, all different bags. Just trying to stay consistent now. Keep working. Yeah, um, man. Hey, go ahead. Sound guy. Uh, damn, I'll never introduce or sign out on this bitch, do I? Go crazy. It slaps, man. We out this bitch. Hey, man, thank y'all for it. <laughs> <laughs> thank I ain't had time to do no long spiel. <laughs> <laughs> it's man, mom. Fresh we ass dudes. <laughs> Who killed Kenny? <laughs> Shout out to Boosie. Kenny, and we out of here, man. Urban Kings and Kings. Urban Kings and Kings. Wow. Urban ladies, King ladies, and Queens <laughs> podcast. Ladies, and we you are out of here first. I got to get a female. You are out of here. I ain't here. got a female yet, man. You're right. <laughs> Urban Kings and Kings, we ain't protecting y'all. This nigga took that shit to another level.